Hi, I'm Rich Newbold. I'm the game director under Asset Audio Evolution 2. And today we're going to be showing you some new dinosaurs and one of the new environments in the game. But we're going to be doing things slightly differently. So please welcome our special guest, Jeff Goldblum. Welcome, Jeff. Welcome to me, I guess, or welcome to us. Uh, <laughs> uh, welcome to the audience, maybe, uh, 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 on this thing called the Future Games Show. First that we have the temperate environment, and some of you will notice it's raining in here. Oh my gosh, yeah, that's rain. It's raining. And this is the first time that we've shown this effect in Jurassic World Evolution 2. Rain is one of the many weather challenges that the player will face as they're building their dinosaur theme parks. For example, in our desert environment, you'll be challenged with sandstorms, which will really put your management skills to the test. This looks lovely. This looks like some kind of resort. And now let's talk about the dinosaurs. We've got two new species to show you today. The first one is the Ichthyosaurus. Oh, this is an underwater dinosaur of some kind. I just did a little snorkeling uh, here and there. I, I, you know, I won't bore you with where, uh, but um, I saw a barracuda under the water all of a sudden after I was enjoying all these little fish, and I was sort of frightened out of my wits. If I'd seen anything like this, can you imagine? Well, actually, you'll be pretty safe with the Ichthyosaurus. Its diet consists mostly of fish and is one of several new exciting marine reptiles that we're bringing to the game. So, so far, this clip is showing off, I would say, mainly dinosaurs. Not only the rain and different environments, which are very impressive and nice, but, uh-oh, here's a pterodactyl or a pteranodon. I don't know the names of them, but there's another flying. His eyes look quite mean. This is the Ciorodactylus. It's got a long beak and sharp teeth, which allow it to dip its head into water whilst keeping aware of any threats nearby. Sadly, that's all we've got time for. I hope you've enjoyed this deeper look at the game. We're really excited for you to experience it yourself on November 9th.